I am baking cookies. Except every ingredient I use is a substitute. So let's see how this goes. What's up guys? It's me Angie and today I am going to be making cookies but not your average cookies. I am going to be substituting every ingredient with a substitute ingredient. Say you have an egg and you substitute it for a banana. That's actually one of the ingredients I'm using. But yeah, that's just kind of an example. But that's what I'm going to be doing for every single ingredient. So let's start. It is a beautiful day and we're making cookies outside. I got everything I need. Oh, shit. Short, short, short. There we go. Uh, you can see the garlic in the frame. Get out of here. Guys, there was no substitute for flour. So we're going to have to use normal flour. So I am using a recipe for two cookies. For the flour, we're gonna need one half cup flour. I wish I had other flour, but I don't. I was saying cornstarch, but like that was actually, I was like skeptical. Okay. So we got the first ingredient in flour. Now it is time for baking soda. Ooh, this giant ass. Oh, it's so heavy. Baking soda. We're gonna need. This is for baking powder. The baking powder is not in the thing, but I'm still going to add that. So the substitute for baking powder is baking soda. So we're going to use one fourth teaspoon. If I can find that. Look how tiny. Boop. Okay. That's literally <laughs> that's all we needed out of this giant bag. Okay. Whoa, that is very heavy still. Now this is, we actually need baking soda for this um masterpiece. Okay. So we need lemon juice one fourth teaspoon again okay just a little i got this lemon juice right here so sorry the substitute for baking soda is lemon juice because it said it's like acidic and can kind of give the same effect oops give that same effect it's kind of fizzing in the baking soda next is salt Yeah, we're using garlic. Okay. Mm, garlic smells so good, but like for salt. This is gonna be kind of nasty. God damn, it's not coming out. Oh my God. Oh my God. That was way too much, it wasn't coming out. Oh my God, okay. This is gonna be so nasty. So next is butter, but the substitute for it is olive oil. Got some olive oil. We need four tablespoons. Okay, I got you. I got you, fam. Let's get four of these bad boys. One. <laughs> Two. Do a little less on this one. Three. Oh, come on, come on. Four. Okay. It's like I'm cooking. I'm not even baking. I'm literally cooking. What is this? not cooking with this recipe though like, this is nasty as hell next is brown sugar which the substitute for it is maple syrup i got some raw maple syrup i think this might be raw i don't know but we need four tablespoons of this as well oh, sorry it's kind of heavy oh come on it's not even open i got a pan let's stab this bitch there we go just got a, a couple pen marks it's fine it's fine it's coming out so slow. Yep, we need to stab it again. RIP. Might taste like ink a little. It's okay though. I just spilled it on my napkin, okay. Okay, we need four of these? Yeah, four, okay. One. Come on! I'm happy I decided to go outside to record this video today because it's finally summertime. It's finally warm, I'm really hot. So I think after this, I might go into the freezing cold pool. It's like 80 degrees today. I was struggling so hard. Okay, next we need white sugar, which also calls for maple syrup. So I have to do that again. It was so heavy. Oh shit, I think I'm supposed to be mixing in between these. I so forgot about that. Okay, I'm just gonna do a little mixy mix right now. Sniff test, sniff test. Why does it actually not smell that bad? It kind of just smells like olive oil. No joke, no joke. Guys, it's actually looking like cookie, cookie dough. 
This is scary. This is really scary. Also, I already preheated my oven to 350 and I'm gonna leave it in there for 12 minutes. Let's get some white sugar in here. I was gonna use honey, but I think our honey's really old. So why should another four tablespoons? Okay. This might take me a second. Let, let me time lapse this to see how long this will take. That actually didn't take that long, but now we need vanilla extract. And for the substitute for vanilla extract is, you guessed it, <laughs> more maple syrup. But we're going to be using elf syrup by good old Miss Butterworths. So let's do this. This is probably a year old. It's fine. It needs one fourth. I'm going to just guess that's teaspoon because I didn't write it down. I should have wrote it down. Yeah, let's just guess. Let's just guess for the fun of it. There we go. Oh, yes, this one comes out way better. Oh, wait, I'm a dumbass. It literally says one fourth, and I just put it in one teaspoon. Okay, we're just gonna pour this in. Oh, that's kind of satisfying, though. Should I taste this after a year? Yes, it tastes good. Tastes good. Disclaimer, it tastes good. We need now an egg which this is the substitute for it a banana fun fact i hate bananas okay we're gonna use this one third cup because i couldn't find one fourth this says you need that much of a Ugh, i hate bananas Ugh. i don't know why just like after i've had it as a kid it's just like too sweet i'm just gonna do this and i didn't mash it it's supposed to be mashed <laughs> okay lastly we need chocolate chips my best and favorite part but we don't, we can't use that. So we got to use some cocoa powder, which I have limited edition cuphead cocoa powder. Ooh, I mean, hot co I was going to use cocoa powder, but then I decided to use hot chocolate. So I could use this baby, this bad boy. Look at this little face. I can remake that. I'm, I'm sorry, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, we need, I don't even know if this is open. Oh my God, look, it's like a little can. Okay, that's actually sick. Crispy pop, crispy pop. Come on, Mike. Ah, there we go. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, we need one third. Ew, this had banana in it. I don't think hot cocoa powder. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna pour that in. Okay, it just flew everywhere. I'm just gonna close that back up. If I can. Oh, shit. Okay. I just dropped the lid. Mm, the hot cocoa powder smells so good though. Okay, we're gonna mix this. Okay, it's getting a little sunnier and I tried to mix as best as I can, but you can literally see there's chunks of fucking banana. Ugh. Ugh. Sorry to the banana lovers, okay? And you see this, this ain't forming into a cookie dough. So I think we should add a little more flour. I'm being a little cheeky, a little sneaky. Let's put some more flour in here. I also got flour all over my shirt. RIP to the sun shirt. When I combine this, will it or will it not actually turn into dough? Because right now it's actually smelling amazing surprisingly smelling amazing like it actually just smells like chocolate cake which is crazy and i think that's mostly because of that cuphead hot cocoa and i think the banana might be helping a little yeah i'm still very worried about that garlic powder that i added in hopefully it's just it just goes away with the with so much chocolate i added maybe the banana saved it the maple syrup if i taste a little bit of that shit it's bad so I made cookies before this just because I wanted cookies. And then I was like, oh, I should make a YouTube video about this. Except you got to make it interesting and substitute every single ingredient with another ingredient. I think if I add more flour, it's just going to taste like flour. So I think I'm going to not add any more flour. And I'm going to put this on a baking tray. Eh. It's looking surprisingly well for all these ingredients that we used. Also, this literally said this is supposed to be enough for two cookies. This is like a literal whole batch. Okay. 
Okay, here's the cookies. These look really bad. They're actually keeping the shape kind of, so I'm gonna put them in the oven. Yay! So while we wait for these cookies to bake, cookies, let's dip our toesies in the water, cause why not? Cool, it's a little, has some little, oh, oh, that's cold. Oh, it looks so nice and aesthetic though. Okay, sleigh pool, but it is cold. Look at, so aesthetic. You're lucky I'm giving you my toesies for free. But I wanted to tell you guys that I am so thankful we just hit 16K subscribers. I am so happy. Like I, oh, you guys are the best and I love you so much. We just hit 16K last night thank you guys so much i appreciate you guys so much i love replying to your comments and you guys are so nice in the comments i love you guys you're the best i have an awesome community yeah my dream is to hit 100k and i definitely think we can achieve that but guys if you want to help me reach to 100k hit the subscribe button right now subscribe subscribe i'm showing you my feet for free come on buddy though we subscribe okay <laughs> also if you guys subscribe right now in three seconds I will take one of those diabolical cookies and eat it in the pool. One, two, three. If you subscribed, I will do it. All right, let's go check on these cookies. Guys, the cookies just came out and they smell like shit and look like shit. Um, I'm really scared to try these. Okay, guys, this is the cookie. This literally looks like a cake. I got this mini one and it smells like shit. Oh, too much garlic. Okay, let's break it open. Also looks like shit. Let's taste. It's a little hot still. It wasn't a bad bite at first. Maddie's right next to me, my sister. You want to try? You don't have to. It kind of tastes like banana bread, but like freaking salty. <laughs> yeah, um, guys, lesson learned. Just don't use substitutes. Only use like one or two substitutes. Now this fat one. And I told I told you guys that if you subscribed, I'd eat it in the pool. So let's eat this in the pool. Ah, why am I eating? <laughs> <laughs> guys, there's literally a chunk of banana right here that I didn't smush. Don't focus on my beautiful face. Focus on this nasty shit. Yeah, it's not focusing, but why do I keep eating it? Well, let's try it in the pool. Here's okay, he's gonna try it before I go in the pool. Okay, here's my YouTube guys right here. It's so beautiful. I'm not adding it. <laughs> in the I'm sorry, I, I will add it. It's really good. Um, <laughs> die, you didn't like it. That tastes like garlic. Hi, guys. Definitely didn't add garlic. Dylan, you wanna try and be in is the it vid? Bad? It tastes like this no, it tastes really like good. Oh. This is my Adabuada. It tastes like the grass. Why is bro actually eating it? Bro, it tastes like poison ivy. That's actually offensive. I worked so hard on this. The fans know how hard I worked on this. Let's go eat this in the pool. All right, let's eat this piece of cookie in the pool. I'm walking in. Okay, I'm in the pool. Oh, oh, it's so cold. Okay, let's take a bite. Uh, don't follow this recipe. So bad. Okay, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. My phone is balancing on a floaties. Okay, <laughs> so I hope you guys really enjoyed, and I'll see you later.